come or, or, or nothing else will occur. But if you remain in this courtroom and make it and make any outburst, I'll have you arrested. Hey, what's up? This your boy, Big Man. You already know what it is, man. So let's get right to it. Okay, so today we're going to be talking about this Gunna situation, man. Now, for those of you who don't know or been living under a rock lately, Gunna is a part of the whole YSL Rico indictment, right? He and Young Thug are alleged to be leaders in this gang that brought forth this Rico indictment in the state of Georgia. Now, they've been going through the process of trying to get bond, and at each turn, they have been denied. And it hasn't been going well for them, man. But news broke that there was a motion filed by the prosecutors, the Atlanta DA's office, that they wanted more time for this trial, man. They wanted to push this trial further down the road. So Gunner's team and Young Thug's team thought this might be an opportunity where they could get bond. Well, Gunner went up again to try to get bond, and was again denied. Now, there was a lot of rumors about what happened. Now, you had Gunner's legal team basically go and say that they had misconstrued some sort of text between two parties that are also in the RICO indictment where somebody alleged to say that they would go to bat for Gunner. You know what I mean? So, essentially, a happy birthday text that didn't involve Gunner at all could have led to his bond being denied. So, obviously, his friends, family, people close to him that understand the pivotal point that he is in in the rap game right now where he should be flourishing. He should be making little baby money. He should be doing it real, real big out here, right? Because before he got locked up, Pushing P was doing well. He was pushing the culture. I mean, him and Young Thug had it locked, man. And then everything came down to a crash and halt. And obviously, those close to him felt that, man. And recently in court, it looks like tempers were flaring, man, from both sides. It seemed like somebody made an outburst in the court, and the judge wasn't feeling that and had to drop the hammer on him, man. Now, before we play this footage and get to the details, do me a favor. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And, man, let's get it. Okay, so let's get to this footage of what went down in court recently, man. You're going to see the judge go off on Gunner's family and friends in this bond hearing let's check it out like i said i will try the case as expeditiously as possible but at this point in time i don't find any change in circumstances that would that would allow me to or move me from changing the uh changing my decision as to um as to bond uh, and if anybody's in the gallery and you can't otherwise control yourself or otherwise make you want to make any appropriate comments then you can leave at this point in time no harm will come or, or, or nothing else will occur. But if you remain in this courtroom and make, it, and make any outbursts, I'll have you arrested. The only thing I can potentially do is, like I said, I will try the case as expeditiously as possible. But at this point in time, I don't find any change in circumstances that would, that would allow me to or move me from changing the... Uh, changing my decision as to um, as to bond uh, and if anybody's in the gallery and you can't otherwise control yourself or otherwise make you want to make any appropriate comments then you can leave at this point in time no harm will come or or, or nothing else will occur but if you remain in this courtroom and make it and make any outbursts i'll have you arrested Okay, now you heard there was a lot going on there in the courtroom, right? You saw a, a lot of people there, and obviously they were there for Gunner, man. You saw the one guy stand up, looked like he had some ladies with him or whatnot, man. It looked like a couple IG models, all sorts of people in there. People from the rap game probably or whatnot, right? And they didn't support for Gunner because they thought that this might be a chance for Gunner to get Bond and actually get back out in the streets, actually get back to doing what he should be doing, which is rapping and making a whole lot of money. I mean, could you imagine how much money Gunner is missing out on right now at this time? You know what I mean? So, like I said, tempers were up. And people started to talk. They started to say things on their way out. One guy said something about black lives, and then another person had said something. And you saw immediately when the first person even grunted, the judge looked up and was like, whoo. It was like quick. He was like, yo, if anybody in the gallery has anything to say or, or can't control themselves, they need to leave now or I'll have you arrested. Now, what you got to realize is 
judges have a lot of power. They're the person that people go to when they want to indict these RICO cases. They're the person that people go to when they want to get arrest warrants. So, man, that judge has the power to have anybody in there arrested on command, man. So just think about that and take that into account. And smartly, everybody left. You know, there was a couple of grunts and a lot of people were saying a few things. But, man, let's look at it one more time. The only thing I can potentially do is, like I said, I will try the case as expeditiously as possible. But at this point in time, I don't find any change in circumstances that would that would allow me to or move me from changing the uh, changing my decision as to um, as to bond. Uh, and if anybody's in the gallery and you can't otherwise control yourself or otherwise make you want to make any appropriate comments, then you can leave at this point in time. No harm will come or, or, or nothing else will occur. But if you remain in this courtroom and make, it, and make any outbursts, I'll have you arrested. Now, you can see through that video, man, this is a difficult time for Gunner and his family and his friends, right? Because they understand the gravity of this situation. They see how somebody could be so high in the rap game, so doing so well. I mean, Gunner was at the Met Gala. You know what I'm saying? He's got Kim Kardashian arguing on his behalf. And now he's in jail stuck, man. And there's nothing he can do about it, man. It all rests on this judge's pen. And it looks like the judge made his decision in the situation. Now, recently, there was a news story that talked about the decision that came down. So let's look at that clip real quick. His real name is Jeffrey Williams. There was a motions hearing this morning. Rapper Gunna, whose real name is Sergio Kitchens, was denied bond. Gunna, Young Thug, and two dozen others were arrested on gang charges. Prosecutors have asked a judge to delay the trial by three months so all of the defendants can secure defense attorneys. So there you have it, man. Gunna's bond was denied another time. His lawyer is trying to get back in there for the fourth time, probably a couple other times, because they feel like this reason for his bond being denied, it just doesn't hold up. They feel like it really, there is really not based in any type of facts or anything of that nature, right? So it's a, it's a tough time, man. I can only imagine. Like, I, I, maybe we can't. I can't understand being that high in the rap game and then also now being in the cell. You know what I'm saying? That's just crazy when you think about it. But man, y'all tell me what y'all think in the comment section, man. Do you think that the judge was being fair before he went off on gun his peoples like that? Or do you think that, man, everybody was, was kind of already on their way out and somebody just decided to say something that had the judge go off. So he was justified. You know what I mean? Now with that, this has been your boy, Big Man. Do me a favor. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And make sure you hit that notification bell. So that way you get a notification every time I drop this hot content. And we out of here. Peace.